Where is he? Where is Sigurd? He... he's alive. But not with you. Where is he? Dag, not now. I need to speak with Ranve. You never found him, did you? Tell us, Eivor! We deserve the truth! I need to speak with Ranvi. Step aside, now! You never found him, because you didn't look! <clears throat> I see you, Eivor! I know what you are. Eivor, you come alone. I fear what that means for Sigurd. I... I could not find him. That madwoman Fulke, she... She slipped away, took him to Suthix. We need an army. Call on our alliances, remind them of their oath to me. We must act before... Before... Before what, Eivor? She tortured him, Ranvi. Did unspeakable things. Severed his arm and left it as a gift. I fear she means to kill him. Slowly. Gods. Stop there, wolf kissed. This ends now. Dag, turn around and walk away. Your habits are not my own, Eivor. I do not flee responsibility for the sake of my glory. I stand firm with my people. For many months, I have stood at your side, keeping faith in Sigurd's judgment. Because I believed in him and his vision. Do as Eivor commands, he told me. And I have. Against my better judgment, I did as you have asked me. And where has that left us? Without a Jarl? Without a purpose? Watching you chase glory around this land like a spooked hare! You could have come to me in confidence, Dag, but that offer is gone. I have no need of it! My mind is fixed. Hear me all! I challenge Eivor for the leadership of this clan until Sigurd is safe home! Walk away, Dag. No! We fight to the death! 
You spew nonsense, Dag. This is absurd. Enough! Let the circle be made! I'll burn you like a suckling pig! to do this. Walk away. You walk a fool's path, Dag. This does not need to happen. A coward to the last. Have courage, Eivor. I will make it quick. See what you do. There is no honor in this. What do you know of honor that Sigurd did not teach you? You suckle at his teeth and then leave him to die. You should have listened. You might have saved yourself. any pity, I would not lavish it on this poor fool. He forced my hand. Yes, and the cost of disrespect is death. You said it yourself. All he demanded you gave him, that should be enough. I have no need for one so fragile in my hall of heroes. He fought for what he believed in. Does that not count for something? Does it? You killed him all the same. What is the true cost of disrespect? The choice lies with you. It should not have come to this old friend. Take this and fly to Odin's hall. Whatever you sought in this life, may you find it in the next. Go to your homes. I will lay him to rest. Go to your homes! 
Dag accused me of betrayal. He accused me of breaking my oath. And this, this is the answer I gave him. Now you will hear the truth unvarnished. None, none more than me wishes for Sigurd's safe return. You know this. You know this. All of you! And I will burn the fields and dredge the rivers of Wessex to find him. That, that is my oath. That is my oath. I will find Sigurd. You will not be without your Jarl. This I promise. lived as you died, proud and defiant. I cannot begrudge you for that. I miss hearing you tell your stories, old friend, but I remember them well. I wonder what became of you. If anything remains of so strong a spirit, I will need to raise the barn if we're going to get the farm ready for the festival. Tekla's brewery has not been built yet. I should do that for her before the festival. 